I'm so freaking happy, guys. Um, as we're aware, I'm training the dogs, yeah? Toilet training. And because um, I'm a sucker, obviously I leave them back in, like I keep leaving them in, that's a given. Um, and I am smoking a joint. Um, I still think a joint is an upgrade from a bong though, so that's awesome. Um, and I've spoken to Rachel again and she's picking up my weed on Friday. So I've said that I'm going to roll enough joints for the remainder of Married at First Sight because it feels like a really good, like summed up all together. I'm going to finish smoking weed and finish watching Married at First Sight at the same time. So I'm going to roll a joint for each episode. Um, today's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday and Sunday. So yeah, I think I'm nearly finished. Then I'm going to put everything in the box and I'm going to tape the box up and put it aside. Hello, baby, look. And, um, uh, freaking hell. Yeah, I'm going to take the box up, put it aside, and Rachel's going to come and get it. Um, but yeah, the reason I'm so freaking happy is this little beauty, yeah, I'm going to turn my camera, um, was inside and they were having dinner, which I still need to organize for myself, and there's only 10 minutes until math starts. Um, and he knocked on the door, like the way I've shown him. So he, he banged on the door. That's mine. That's mine. And he came outside and he did a poo. And I just feel so happy. And obviously I'm never going to have like children, children. But I imagine this is like the next best thing. And I just feel so freaking proud. Here's my babies. I've got a real soft spot for Bullet because I've just literally never had a puppy this freaking small before. What he just did to my dog. Um, yeah, they're just so freaking cute, guys. Um, but I am very happy with my day and how it's gone. Um, even with my don't drink my drink, even with the whole um, clearly having a smoke and a drink in the middle of the day. I only had that one drink and that was it. I'm on a uh, creamy soda now. Um, and yeah, weed's better than booze anyway, let's face it. Um, but I'm gonna stop talking, post this. Oh, one other thing though, while I do remember, because I've had to like barricade, so to speak. Ooh, I'll go for a walk and I'll show you, but um, I better pick up the joint because we don't want the puppies to do anything with that. All right, so let's see, this is my house, my yard, whatever, there's my bike. And here we go, right? That is a big pun in the butt, right? Because my, Yard is clearly obviously dog proof, yeah? These guys are tiny. So they had to like, as you can see, use boards, bricks, blankets, the whole thing to make sure every single gap is totally filled in, right? But in doing so, it's made getting my motorbike out even more annoying. So I've decided <laughs> I've my friends told me it's probably not wise because of where I live, but I'm just choosing to have faith like everything else. But I've decided, for the sake of me actually learning how to ride my motorbike better, getting the practice, doing the hours, riding every week, which I want to, but it's it's such a chore in my head just to get the bike out. So I don't, and that's really what it comes down to. Um, my inner whatever is very lazy. Like, I'm aware of that. I'm openly honest about that one. Um, but yeah, I want to learn how to be a good motorbike rider. And the only way that's going to happen is if I ride the motorbike. So I'm going to put it on the other side of the gate with the turntable. Because again, can't actually turn my bike with that one. Um, oh, these guys are happy. I should probably just leave them out here for a bit. Um, my show's going to start in fuck all time. And I'm standing here talking to you guys, myself while I want to be smoking my joint, which I obviously can't smoke inside because it is around the dogs. Um, but anyway, yeah, the motorbike's going to go on the other side of the... Oh, Jesus! The fuck? You guys have got short, sharp claws. Um, yeah, basically, this is my attempt at uh, making everything easier for myself, so I actually ride it because I really, really want to ride it to um, Mez's house tomorrow. I've asked my neighbour to help me. I just feel like it's the wisest thing to do, I guess. Um, just to move everything out correctly, make sure it's all sort of back doggy proof enough. Um, 
just moving the turntable and shit too. I just need some help. Just yeah, especially since I want to ride the bike afterwards. Um, but that's where I'm at. I've realized I say that sentence, that's where I'm at um, almost in every fucking video. <laughs> I guess that's because it is where I'm at. Um, but yeah, I've talked for long enough. This is like my fourth video for the day. So I'm done. I'm going to eat food, smoke weed, and watch maths. <laughs>